Well, I know a lot of you follow Scottish football very closely. And Alan Smith is with me, Martin Tyler, for today's game. Yeah, delighted to be here. Let's have a look now at the Celtic team. Just to check on the formation. 4-4-2, but an interesting variation on it. Yeah, a little diamond in midfield, and uh, I wouldn't be surprised at some point. If it's not working, he'll go to a more conventional 4-4-2. This is how the visitors will line up today. Well, it does look a bit negative, this, Alan. Can you see some positives in the 4-5-1? It's all about attitude, really, Martin, isn't it? How much those wide lads in the midfield do want to get forward, whether one or two in the middle can make runs beyond the lone striker. We'll see. Well, first versus third, and both teams showing some... Tremendous qualities in this season so far, and I think they've got stickability about them in terms of being able to last the course. But uh, out there today, there might not be too much difference between the two teams. Well, that's very good positional play, and he's uh, read the situation perfectly with that interception. Well blocked. Deflected behind. A clear corner. Good jump. And the header just off target. And he's gone for that corner. Only just missed it. You have to play it the way you're facing sometimes, even if you're facing your goalkeeper all that distance away. Woods. And it's out of play. Woods. It's a quick play. Shots on here. It's in for the goal. And he'd have enjoyed that. I don't think he scored many better. The composure to place it to the left. commentators do on the previous meeting which was a draw um, does, we could be in oh that's embarrassing what a shame for the lad look at the looks he's getting off his teammates they thought he was going to score but he's missed by a distance goal news from St Johnston it's a goal for Inverness Caledonian Thistle 20 minutes played 1-0 cheers Alan Trying to widen the approach play here, but it's out for a throw in. Will be their throw. The good thing about these pitches these days, even when we're getting rain like we're getting here. It just goes straight through. It does, and uh, it means the ball moves so fast across the surface. And, uh... Can he shut off now? Terrific stop. And now they've got a corner from the attack again, the team that's leading by one goal. It's a real tussle between the two of them to try and get the ball. with the Celtic players. The cross coming in. Played it well. Wa 
Barcassa. And that's good support as they build this attack. Goal kick now. And here's the replay again. Yeah, maybe giving the keeper a chance with the height of the shot, but it was enough to beat him. Going into this game for the home side, they're in great form, aren't they? Four consecutive wins, but, uh, a chance to make it five in a row. Yeah, they must go out on the pitch there. Full of confidence, the way that they've been playing, creating chances, taking them, very good. Well, he's appealing <laughs> he was on side but no way no I think it's uh, time just to get back in position forget about that one well there's going to be three minutes added on now Brown and the tackler has been very successful there he's got possession Half time signaled by the referee 1 0 the half time score. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half? Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. So the referee's happy, the players are in position, the second half gets underway. McShane. Back it goes to the keeper. Well, they're back defending and they've cut the pass out there. And maybe that will ease the pressure. Goal news from St Johnston. It's a second goal for Inverness Caledonian Thistle. 52 minutes played, 2-0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. Woods. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. Very good passing from this team. He's given the free kick. It's in a really trending position too. Goal is number 19. Was there it wasn't quite the goal. I think the keeper might have been relieved there, Martin, because I don't think he would have got there. Higher up the pitch, the home team. Yeah, they really need to put the opposition into more pressure than they have been. Successful tackle. Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Now the shot! Oh! Johnston. It's a penalty for St Johnston. He's put the ball down on the spot. Here he comes. A oh, great penalty. Goalkeeper didn't move high to the goalkeeper's left. 66 minutes played. 2 1. And he could get away here. And he goes on goal. In on goal. And certainly it was an easy job for the keeper. 
the officials are a bit concerned with the heaviness of the rain half an hour or so ago. They're always concerned whether the ball can be moved freely and whether it's safe to play in that respect. Yeah, but goes for it with a fist. Wakasa. And shoots! And it's a shot that the goalkeeper can deal with quite comfortably. be critical these players are so good but i have to point out that he's not having a very good time of it at the moment no quite often when the ball's played in his first touch has not been right and that's given him a problem the position of been able to close him down substitution taking place now it's a real tussle between the two of them try and get the ball Kick here. Substitution. Going on is number 28. Here's Brown. Wakasa. Shots off. The ball's loose. Celtic has scored. to a goal like that. Oh, talk about luck, the keeper makes a good save but straight into the path of the attacker. Well, we're in the last few minutes now and the die has been cast in this game, really. That was the referee's decision. Two added minutes. Shot on! Into the challenge, he made the block. Handball. Now this is dangerous. Yeah, it's going to be interesting to see. I think he maybe could have done better than to get his arm to that ball. He's defending from the defensive wall on the jump. No danger at all for the goalkeeper here or for the defending team. And they... That's the end of the contest. They never let up, did they? They kept on going to make this a very big margin of victory. Yeah, they were ruthless actually. Quite often, last 10 or 15, you, you ease off, but this team didn't.